Welcome back to the Ghost Game. I am Gray, and today we have another one of these uh, League Cup matches going on. Um, first and foremost, I know I haven't been uploading much recently. Um, reason being is I was kind of feeling under the weather for a while. And we also happened to kind of take a little, not really a vacation, but we had took a little uh, weekend trip which actually didn't fall on our weekend days for us. But anyway, we took a weekend trip and, and to like a little reptile convention so we could buy some more snakes and all that good shit. So, yeah. So I haven't really been recording much of anything. And I also kind of took some time off away from this save file specifically for the sake of it just pissing me off. So, now that it's, you know, now that I'm kind of uh, back into the swing of things and I'm, you know, less pissy. We're gonna get back into this. Um, uh, another thing, uh, I am working on this little formation. Um, I kind of just shit this thing out recently. Um, uh, the reason being is, yeah, I was just playing with stuff, and I took our original. I took this basically and just kind of, oops, and just kind of changed the formation to uh, to that. So, um. That's pr this is probably something I'll work on with our friendly games because um, I would really like to get this working. I'm, I'm very interested in, in seeing where it goes. It's basically, you know, as you can see, it's a 4 2 three, one, just without a striker. We just move everybody back. Um, it's kind of interesting. I like I like the way it works, but um, I took out the other the five five zero thing. I took that out because obviously, like I said, we don't have any sweepers, and it's gonna be a long time before we get one probably. Um, so I'm gonna shelve that one for now. Um, and, and hide that fucker away and just say to hell with it. So, anyway, we're going to get back into this thing and, um, start playing this save file, um, or save file, this, this formation. Um, anyhow, um, I don't even remember if last time there were anybody to, to, well, if we had any, anyone join since the last episode. So if we did, I don't know if Bachman, I, I, I probably, I don't remember, it's been so long. I haven't recorded in fucking forever. Um, because again, like I said, kind of busy, and then I got sick there for a while, and then now I'm feeling better. And like I said, we took some time away and did some shit and, um, all that good stuff. I do need, we do, well, we do have, uh, oh, geez. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna go back out there and have some fun and shits. Yeah. That's pretty much all I got. I'm not really all that. Yeah, I did have Bachman because he has played a match for us. Not really all that um, worried about worried about going anywhere in this in this tournament. Um, like I said, uh, you know, it, it, like I said, I kind of just gave up on it. And I hate to say that, but I have. Um, however, in truth, um, I know I've mentioned this before. I usually get off to pretty slow starts anyway. I kind of have a little bit of a Brendan Rodgers syndrome. So, I mean, we usually takes a while for us to catch our stride. And you saw that, too, last season. Of course, it didn't have to we were changing formation so fucking frequently. But anyway, that's all um, that's all water under the bridge as of right now. So we're just going to kind of um, keep trucking with uh, our little 3-4-2-0 formation. Or 2-0-2-1 two, two, formation. And then we'll, we'll go from there. Um... Ooh, look at that, Robbie, all alone, and nice, ooh, ooh, that was close, that was close, so very fucking close, but anyway, um, like I said, I really don't have much, much else, I don't remember what else was going on, um, I am going to start recording, I didn't mention this, I probably should have before I started the video, I am going to start recording Lord of the Rings and all that shit, again, here soon, hopefully, um, girlfriend is in the process of getting a new computer and building a new computer i should say so um i've been kind of quite honestly laying off of that like kind of just waiting for that to happen just because i'm lazy quite honestly any excuse to say hey uh let's just wait is an excuse i usually take so i'm a procrastinator what can i say so anyhow um oh y'all is gonna get to that too oh oh so close. So close. We're getting better movement and stuff out of this formation though today. I mean, this is... Like I said, like, this formation is more... 
like I was actually thinking about this the other day too. I mean, I I, I like this formation because it, it we surrender usually a surrender a good amount of possession, but at the same time, you know, we tend to limit tend you know when we play well we tend to limit the opposition's shots, which. I mean, like I said, I, I mean, ideally you want possession, but I mean, if you if the other team doesn't have a whole lot of shots on goal or a whole lot of shots, period, you know, I guess I guess that's half the battle, right? So I mean, because I noticed I was using this in my other on one of my other games, and and oh my, and it's very successful. I mean, it was very successful in, in the domestic competition, which is interesting because like I haven't had success with this formation um, like in the Champions League. Of course, I don't use it like once, but I mean, which mean which means like when, when you're, you know, when you use this in the Champions League, you're of course going to be playing against the best in Europe, and typically they're going to be of equal quality, if not just a little bit better than your team, at least for a while. You know, like I said, didn't didn't really have great results. Um, however, um, you know, I mean. However, when I use it with with Viking, which you know the, the other teams in the Norwegian Premier Division are probably, if not at least equal quality, probably a little bit better than we were. And like I said, we still we still got really good results out of it. But so I mean, I, I think this is what we're primarily going to stick with. It'll be a little boring because it's not going to be super adventurous. I mean, I, you know, it is what it is. But um, you know. That's it. said, it's, it is what it is. I don't know what else to really say about it. Other than, you know, hopefully we'll fucking defend. Right? Right? I am looking at, ooh, there are some other players. I was, I was checking this out. There are a few other players that we had the opportunity to sign. We just don't have enough money right now. Um, I mean, ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. I thought that was in for a second. There is like a German player, but he wants like fucking two thousand a week. I mean, like that's like our entire wage budget, you know. But what is open to signing with us, which is nice. It's just we don't have the wage budget, which is annoying as fuck. So he would really, really help out our defense if we could sign him. But you know, once again, I mean, I'm not really, not really too concerned with it because this season, I mean, the first season is just all about staying up. I, mean, I think we'll be all right. I think we can stay up. You know, I mean, I've never, I've never really, I should say this, I've never gone up to a division and finished lower than mid-table. So, I mean, which is, if you know anything about football, then you know that's pretty damn good. I mean, to, to, to win promotion to a, to a higher, oh, fucking hell, really? Jesus. Completely unchallenged, and you can't fucking head the ball without hurting your dumb ass. Fuck you. Fuck you. You know, I haven't checked. I bet she's got like a really high fucking injury proneness rating. Gotta stay away from them fuckers. They'll ruin everything, I swear. But, you know, it is what it is. Just get him the fuck out of there and. I don't know, we might actually end up playing, uh, you know, I should take a look at Gronholm. Could Gronholm play on that other side? Negatory. What about, uh, what about... Sox oh, Soxalo can. So... We have some options, at least. Some... No, oh, fuck. Completely missed that, you did. There was a lot of that in FM15, by the way. The little player where they go up to go head it off or cut it off and just completely whiff on it. There's a lot of that. That was kind of annoying. It's like, why don't you just not do that? But hey, you know, that's alright. Just go out there, fuck it up. But anyhow. Oh my. No say. That wasn't, that wasn't terrible. That's. Arinz is better in the air too, quite honestly. Or should be better than Robbie anyway. Oh, um, ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, 
This isn't bad so far. I mean, I, I don't, I don't expect the win. Oh, nice. Well done. Oh my. He really should be scoring more often. It's, it's really, really irritating that he doesn't score as much as he should. He's got, he's got a lot of the tools. It just doesn't come off more for some reason. So, but anyhow. Oh, the human and two-footed. That fucker. That's an auto re automatic red right there. Yeah, get the fuck out, you little punk ass bitch. Ain't nobody like you. Ain't nobody love your ass. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. We're still probably gonna lose though. <laughs> Quite honestly. Ooh, really whipped that fucker in there. Anyhow, um. Well, the scoreline where it is right now kind of puts us in a predicament. It kind of puts us in a predicament. She would say, I is not be happy as... Or should we go with unlucky boys? Oh. We got nothing out of that one. Well, like I said, most likely going to lose to 10-man Mariam. But oh well. Like I said, I've... I've kind of, let's say, I kind of, I kind of gave up on this. Like I said, I wasn't prepared for it. Now that we know that we have this tournament early in the season, I mean, now we can easily get, you know, now, now we can, now we know what we're dealing with. Because like I said, I don't, I don't, I'm not super familiar with the Finnish Premier Division or anything. Ooh, good half chance there, good half chance. So, I mean, like I said, I wasn't quite wasn't familiar with their scheduling practices or if we were in any extra tournaments or anything like that. But like I said, now we know and we can better prepare for it next season. Because I was seriously hoping for just a shit ton of friendlies and just roll through that and get everyone up to speed. But. And now we're going to get cards everywhere. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Do I have this? Is this, is this where it needs to be? Okay, yeah, I did take the uh, stay on feet off. Yeah now yeah now everyone's getting fucking cards. Yeah. Got to loves it. I should probably just take him off a hassle anyway. And there's no fucking point. I love how yeah, I love how now that they're down a man, they're not committing any fouls. Their their foul count hasn't gone up one since then. It ours, obviously has, because you know, hey, we're just fouling fucking everyone, but that's something too. I've no. I, ooh, wow! That was a fucking terrible pass. Now everyone's got all this fucking like non-committal defending. I hate that shit, by the way. I know I've kind of kind of called it like assertive defending before, and that's a really good way to describe it. Like that non-committal. Should I kind of stand there and go after it, or should I just think about it for ten minutes and then say, "Hey, ball, come here." So yeah, now now they're starting to get their feet under them now. All because my my halftime team talk was shit. Oh sweet Christ! Somebody clear that. Yeah, now they're gonna start controlling the ball. That that is also another another. Ooh, let's see. you got a half chance to run at that there. <laughs> And yeah, and they're like, oh shit, where do I go with the ball? I don't fucking know. Oh, nice passing. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. We might be alive in this motherfucking thing after all. If we can hold on to this. If we hold on to this, we still have, still have half a shot. Because we still got two matches left. We still got my pog in. And who the fuck the other club is? Rops. So that's who it is. Or OPS. I'm not gonna attempt to pronounce their full names because yeah. It's it's a bit difficult. That's one thing I do like about Finnish football. I don't like <sighs> this is assholeish of me to say too. One thing I like about Finnish football is most of their clubs have abbreviated names like that. Or I guess abbreviated slang terms. You know, like F C Enter, as you see there, F C Lati, H J K. I mean, if you were to see what that actually is, it's 
super fucking long. And VPS, ROPS, ROPS, MIPA. I mean, yeah, they got all these really long, long names. Oh, boy, that's cool. Oh, my. How in the hell did you save that? Oh, he was off sides anyway. Well, fuck him. Fuck him. I thought he was on sides. Holy shit. But anyway, with all those abbreviations and shit, it makes it a lot easier for for uh, people who don't speak the language to reference them. Like I said, kind of kind of asshole thing to say, but... You know, like I said, it's, it's nice. Especially for, oh, we're going to have both of our wingbacks score today. Oh, Rins, that's, that's definitely his first goal ever for us. Oh, and that's, that's a 2 mil lead. See, that's another thing another thing I like about this formation. I mean, we kind of, when we can move players around, of course, we have the man advantage, so there's a hell of a lot more space out there now. But and that's really, like, those those last two goals are really results of being them being a man down because they're unable to stretch and fill the gaps as well as they would have otherwise. Not to say our passing wasn't good, because our passing was pretty good there on, on both goals, but it's just, I mean, it's simple stuff, just finding the open spaces, pretty much where the defenders are not at present, or the, you know, just passing into the space that they vacate, basically. That's really what football's about, though. I mean, it's just pass where the defenders aren't, but the ball where the defenders aren't, just, you know, it's kind of a kind of a game where you kind of just play keep away. I mean, in, in all honesty, I mean that's that's what also like the passing into space instruction is. Oh, Orens, if you'd have just like stopped your run, like period, you would have you would have been able to easily intercept that. Oh, to go. That's it. That's gonna be a goal kick, right? Yeah. Yeah. So anyway. Two goals to the good. I'm pretty happy about that. I said some pretty good, uh, pretty good passing and shit too. And then the support wingers like Arends and shit. We are gonna, um, ooh. we are gonna. I think I've said this before. We are gonna use those wingers as more, uh, or put more attackers back there, kind of like status in the last season. We we will look to do more of that. I think. Um... Yeah, because, I mean, I've tried it a little bit, and it's actually worked out. Fucking Christ. <sighs> Fuck you, you fucking piece of shit. Ugh, and now I can't even fucking substitute the right fucking asshole out of here. <sighs> yeah, that's that's been nothing short of super fucking annoying. Seriously, all the fucking injuries. I mean, we got three players out injured already. And now, a fourth and a fucking fifth. I mean, what the fuck? Although, you know, I can't be too upset with the Reds. I think the Reds will play halfway decent over there. I mean, you know, you don't, that's something too. You don't really need super great players to play those wingback positions, I've noticed. I mean, I've had players out there that are arguably the weaker players. I mean, you know, they're just they're not as good players. You know, they're not, not great players that I have on my team. They're... So sort of one could easily perceive as a weak link, and they can, and they still perform pretty well. Ooh, that was a wonderful pass. Look at that. I mean, or her all, you got it. Oh, you motherfucker, you dick that all up. That should have been a goal for that. That pass deserved a fucking goal. I mean, that was just wonderful. Absolutely fucking wonderful. Oh Jesus, that was nice shit. Nice tight control in there too. But. See, I like, I see, I love this formation. When, of course, as I've said before, I mean, it's mostly because they're down a man. And we have all this room. But, I mean, I just, just like this formation a lot. I mean, I feel, I feel safe. You know, I like where, where it attacks from. You know, albeit as long as, oh, fuck. Alright. That wasn't too bad. That's a tough angle to shoot from right there with the defender in front of you anyway. So, I mean, I can't, I can't be too pissy with the defensive effort there. I mean, I can if I really want, but, you know, fuck it. The only other thing, ooh, the only thing that's really bad about this formation is, like, I have noticed when teams just sit back and defend, I mean, when they, you know, arguably park the bus, and, you know, and it, it's hard to break teams down with this formation if they do that. 
So you kind of gotta. I mean, you kind of just have to eat it, really, and just deal with it and hope you make that breakthrough. And that's where you d depend on your players, your players' uh, individual ability and all that good shit. So. All in all, though, I mean, I'm pretty happy with the result, minus the two fucking injuries and the three goddamn guards. I mean, I guess we get the goals, the shit that matters, all right? Oh, my. Oh, my. Gonna go over the top again. Please score. Please make this. No, fucking. You took that shot too, too early. One more touch would have been better. One more touch. I think this formation kind of will give, like... Should bring like the best out of Owusu and uh, uh, and Hagblum as well. At least in my opinion, I mean, giving Hag putting Hagblum back in his his um, natural position, I think, should help out. Um, obviously, having him. Oh Jesus! I thought that was gonna be a foul on Arins and have him get sent the fuck off. That would have really pissed me off right there. That would have ruined the whole fucking two goal win and everything. But anyhow, all right, two nil, two goals to the good. I'm a, I'm okay with that. That wasn't so bad. Of course, as I've said, minus two fucking bullshit injuries. But see, and that's something too. I can't even fucking do anything about it because, you know, this is this is our you know our preseason basically. So I mean, I can't even I can't even sit back and train these fuckers, you know, fitness wise and hopes of, you know not incurring a shit ton of injuries but anyhow that does it for this episode if you made it this far on youtube you know what to do thanks a lot for watching and remember the ghost key is the only place where pants are optional